How's it going, everybody? I'm Nikki Delventhal, and these are my dogs, Rodney and Camper Delventhal. For over three years, we lived in a Toyota Prius, but now we're in a 4x4 Sprinter. And we're here to take you along on the wild ride. So fasten up your seatbelts and let's have some fun. Don't forget, if you like what you see, like, subscribe, comment, share with your friends, and turn on notifications. We would be so thankful. how I get woken up every morning. You guys ready for the day? I think that's a yes. I got some condensation. It's not a day in van life if you don't smack yourself on something. Look who decided to join the caravan. Good morning, Sarah. Good morning. <laughs> Do you need help? I got you, mister. Hi, <laughs> Good morning, Sarah. Hi. This really is the best way to wake up. I know. The weather has been just about as indecisive as we are lately. Uh, so it's normally 80 degrees at this time of year. It was in freezing temperatures last night and hailing. So wild. The boys and I need our go-go juice in the form of caffeine and raw food. Sarah, you want some? No, thank you. All right, serve yourself. Let's cover this baby up. I have been waiting for this moment since midnight last night. I was like craving a good cup of coffee. Does it get any better than this? I mean, come on. I've got my dream home. I've got my best friend, my best friend, and my best friend. And we're outdoors. This is amazing. Hey, Sarah B. Hey, Nikki D. What do you think about doing a car tour? Because it's been two months of you living on the road and going over things that you want to change or that you would do differently. I think that would be really cool. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah? Sure. All right. Should we get changed first? Pajama tour! <laughs> <laughs> well, hello. Did you guys make a friend? Brief intermission from the car tour because more dogs showed up. We got some happy boys. <laughs> Holy moly. Woo, get a camper. In case you guys are new here, this is cousin Sarah. We are family. We are family. I love this big family. And she just moved into her RAV4 two months ago and finally made it from the East Coast all the way west to come caravan with us. We are so excited. So Sarah, take it away. So this bin is my closet. All of my clothes are in here. And I'm sitting on my very comfortable bed. What is the bed made out of? <laughs> it's just a mattress topper and it's covered with a sheet all the way around. Now, was the bed always like this? No, my mom cut it in half for me. So it used to go all the way and now it's cut in half. So one is right on top of it. So it's a little bit thicker, which makes it more comfortable. Yeah, that's great. It also optimizes space really beautifully. Yeah. When I first moved into my Prius, I had a memory foam mattress that was in six pieces. It was so bad, but I didn't have the money to buy a new one yet. So just kind of kept it for a year. Moving on to the passenger side. What do we have in here, Sarah? We've got my towel hanging up, extra things, my computer, a cooler and dishes on top. So what are the extra things? 
big bottle of shampoo, conditioner, soap, things for dishes and cleaning, all that good stuff. For anyone who is wondering or new here and thinking about this, I am someone who had a cooler and a really expensive Yeti cooler and a fridge. And I will tell you a fridge with a battery source is a game changer. Oh, right? and a jar oh. of peanut butter. <laughs> <laughs> the most important part of the tour. It just kept leaking, so I just put it over there. Sounds like something I would do. Yeah. Family. All right, Sarah, moving on. Okay. This is where the magic happens, huh? Yeah. <laughs> oh, camper. Camper, you want to give the tour? He likes sleeping in little cars. He misses I, the Prius. I can see that. Rodney, you want to go in too? No, you'll help Sarah. Look, we have matching shoes. Nice. Dope. All right, what do we have here, Sarah? In this bin, I have paper towel, toilet paper, a bug net, and this is also where I store my window cover at night. Nope, not at night. During the day, I use them at night. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, actually, this window cover is Bug One net. of the coolest things I've ever seen. Bug net window cover. Thank you for the thing. Can we show them? Sure. It's all, right. all magnetic and it goes on the sunroof and it opens up like this. That is one of my favorite things ever. Honestly, I'll put it in my Amazon shop links. So if anyone does want one for their sunroof, it is incredible. I think camper misses being in a car. Oh, a hundred percent. All right, coming around. Oh, hi, Sarah. Hey, fancy, fancy seeing you see here. Oh, we saw oh, that at the same time. <laughs> Up here is the trash when we're parked long term. Yeah, that's where I keep it. What's over here besides a cute dog? Um, that is where I keep my winter coat as well as some of my skiing things, but now I'm not going to need it any longer. Love that all season. I love this process of moving into a car and stuff because not only is it really reminiscent of my time living in a Prius, but it's so relatable. Like when I first moved into my Prius, I had pretty much, actually, I packed it out, but I didn't have a roof box. I didn't have a bike or any of that stuff. And I love it. I'm really excited to see where it goes. Yeah. Yeah. What do you think the next big change would be? Um, step up my cooking gear. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Next up is a kitchen. Yeah. Would you do any cool, like, build out back here, like, have a platform? I don't think so. I think I could cook in my bed. That's a good idea. Yeah. Mac and cheese, baby. <laughs> Maybe something a little bit better. <laughs> <laughs> but it works, you know? What do you think the next upgrade you need actually is? Something to charge my devices. Actually, let me go get that for you. Uh, so last night I plugged it in in my garage so she would be at 100% again today. I've been using my Jackery for four years. It has saved me on the road. I use it for cooking, charging my devices, and really any of my power needs. Not only can you charge it through an electrical port like I did in my garage, but you can also charge it while you're driving or directly through the sun with their solar panels. If you would like one for yourself, please use the link in my description as that really helps out Camper RV and I, but also using that link gets you a huge discount. So thanks in advance. And Sarah, I think this one's yours, girl. Thank you. Of course. We love you. Love you too. All right. This place is starting to get really, really packed with weekend traffic. So what do you guys say we go for a little hike and then get out of here to our next destination? Cool. Let's go. Cool beans. Cool beans. <laughs> Why did I just fart? <gasps> you guys, look, there's two Prius. Beans. Camper, remember when we used to live in one of those? He's like, hell yeah, I do. Let's do it again. Comment below if you want us to move back in the Prius, because fun fact, I kept it. And my dad camps in it right now, actually. Actually, Sarah, you want some breakfast first? I would love an egg. We'll All right, I'm on it. Thank you. Have fun. On it. <laughs> gotta get our little sourdough baby. I also gotta feed him this morning. That smells so good. Look at the dogs. 
look at this. You are a chef. I know. When I cook for other people, I'm not that lazy. Breakfast of champions. Thank you. For a champion. Look at this thing. It's a tiny little plate. Bing. <laughs> not even sitting. That's okay. Mmm. That's real good. First round of cleaning. All right, time to work off that breakfast, ladies and gentlemen. First, we go through the forest of the cars, then through the valley of the pit toilets. We made it to one of the trailheads. After you, Sarah B. <laughs> You're looking beautiful today, honey. Look, some of the climbers. So cool. This is the first place I really got into outdoor rock climbing. It's a good place. Yeah, it's so cool. I wonder if they're created by wind and just the materials that crack off. We should look into it. Look, I'm a tree. <laughs> I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure this is a foxtail. A foxtail can kill your dog. Uh, last year, Camper inhaled one through his nose and he had to get last minute surgery. And if we didn't catch it within 24 to 48 hours, it could have lodged all the way down and ended up killing him. Sometimes they go through into your stomach, into dog's lungs. It's a really scary thing. So if you're not from the area or a place with them, Keep an eye out. Boys, we're almost there. We're going right to that tip. We made it to the top. Look at that view. Doesn't look real. I know, right? Sarah V. Yeah. You know what to do? Go to the top. Let's go. We are heading back to civilization, but first we gotta get back to our respective homes. So we'll see you when we get there. Home, sweet home. Let's get these boys some water and get out of here. Here you go. Come on. This looks like the perfect timing to get out of here. It's getting so busy. Here we go. <laughs> that stall gets me every time. Here we are. All right, first things first, let's get our shower stuff. Shampoo, conditioner, towel, pajamas, shower shoes. I'm so excited. Looks like Sarah B is already inside. That's exclusively because my driving is so slow she got here 10 minutes before me. <laughs> Oops. Knees over toes, baby. This is how I healed my meniscus without surgery. Are we 
we matching? That's so weird, yes. word i feel the same way there's also nothing like a boiling hot shower i hope it gets hot so the closest place that is legal to park is like 15 or 20 minutes away we can do a truck stop or we can do a rest stop Sarah B. what's the truck stop i think it's a pilot i can do that pilot it is Hey! Hey yo boys! Hey yo camp! We're gonna hang this here to dry. Turn off the fan. Okay, here we are. Yeah, I don't think we are. The sign right there says one hour parking. Is that what that says? Honestly, it doesn't say one. It says O. E. Should we flip a coin? Okay. All right, you flip a coin. <laughs> well, that was good. I think because you're gonna have to move your car to find it, that's a sign we should go somewhere safe. It's tails, that means go. We're going to the rest stop, baby. So in case you missed what was going on in between all that fun and chaos, uh, Pilot has a sign that says one hour parking only. I'm actually noticing this is a trend across everywhere in the area. I used to sleep at Walmarts here a few years ago and now you're not allowed to. So we're gonna go another 10 minutes up the road to a rest stop that I know we're able to sleep at, or at least I hope we're able to sleep at. Let's find out. Um. All right, let's go, boys. Come on, boys, go potty. That's my girl, backing in for safety. I taught her well. Myself, on the other hand, we're slacking. You know, we're gonna back in after all. Excuse me, excuse me. We've been inspired. Look at that parking job. Honestly, you guys, it's always a good call to go on the safe side. So we always back in to our parking spots. Little trash drop off. Mine's right there. Be right back. Oh, thanks. I cleaned up. Nice. I didn't. <laughs> Come on in. <laughs> Come on, boys. Welcome. No, I'll clean up. Hang on. You ready? One, two, three. Not too shabby, eh? I just hit everything over here, truthfully. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Only a few things. My valuables. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, you sexy mother truckers. <laughs> what time is it? It's dinner time. Oh, there he goes in his handstand. <laughs> All right, here you go. Delvin your hands stand together, stay together. Can you guess what we're having for dinner? Steak. <laughs> Close. <laughs> <laughs> Look at these masterpieces. I love salad night. It's been salad night every night. Every day is the best day of my life. My dad told me that every single day since I was like able to talk, I would just go to him. Isn't this just the best day of your life? That's cute. <laughs> it's so on brand. Now that we've had our salads, what do you guys say? Uh, we have a wild Saturday night here at the rest stop. <laughs> <laughs> this is my favorite part. You don't have to leave bed. But wait, there's more. Guess who's joining the slumber party? Me! Come on in! <laughs> Bless you. 
I knocked my head on that. <laughs> that looks like it hurt. It didn't hurt at all. <laughs> it's been head. a while. It has been a while. How nice is this? You want to know what else is really awesome? Hmm. Camper's face is on my shirt. That is awesome. You're getting one soon. I'm waiting for mine to exchange it. The bowl to the dog. All night, Rodney was curled up on my face and Camper was sprawled out across my legs. Mm. And then there was Sarah. What about me? <laughs> Camper's keeping a watch. Would it go boy? Rodney, what are you doing? All right, time to get ready, boys. Let's go. stuff. Okay, cool. See ya. What I wanna be ya. As always, dogs first. We gotta take them to go potty. Finding the perfect spot. Back in, boys. Come on. No, boys, back in. One of the perks of being at a rest stop is that you have the bathrooms, you're not using your own water supply. It's kind of nice. Uh, although you do have a lot of highway traffic. Kind of sounds like white noise after a while. I like it. Ready? Ready. Perfect, thank you. That was one of those rest stops that you leave feeling dirtier, for sure. Am I right or am I right? You're right. Yeah. Let's get some sun in here. Excuse me, boys. All right, let's get back on the road. The rest of the day was a pretty basic city day. We left the rest area and went back into town to work. Though the coffee shop was super busy, so I decided to work the rest of the day in the van and just make my own coffee. Then the usual gym, shower, and find another camp spot. Honestly, I love when cousin Sarah joins us, so the rest of the week we spent time together going to Joshua Tree, hitting up some hot springs, and just enjoying each other's company. Thanks so much for being here. Don't forget, like, subscribe, click on that bell to make sure you know when we're uploading, and we'll see you next Friday as usual. Taking bets. How many months till Sarah gets a dog? <laughs> <laughs> Last question. Yes. When are you getting a dog? Scale of one to ten, how quick are you getting a dog? <laughs> <laughs> All right, taking bets. <laughs> <laughs>